As it is, I rejoice, not because you were grieved, but because you were grieved into repenting. For you felt a godly grief, so that you suffered no loss through us. For godly grief produces a repentance that leads to salvation without regret, whereas worldly grief produces death. 2 Corinthians 7, 9 and 10. In these verses, Paul expounds for us what it is to be grieved in a godly way. He says it outright, godly grief, when we are confronted with our sins and the result of them, the effects of them on our lives and the lives of others, we are moved with godly grief to repent of these sins. But if we are moved with a worldly grief, that is a selfish grief, we are moved not to repent. It's so sad that how many in our world this day repent in a worldly way. I'm sorry I got caught for this, that, or the other. I'm sorry for myself. This is not godly repentance. When you repent, may it be a godly repentance. I'm sorry against you, you only, O Lord, have I sinned. You're listening to Orazio, part of your morning drive for the soul, here on Worldwide KFUO, Christ for you, anytime, anywhere.